I'm Pat Gunn, and this is a Let's Play of Fallout 3. So, let's see if we can remember what we were doing last time. Okay, we don't have too much random junk on us. And we were going to go down and clear out the Lincoln Memorial and, and get a picture of some stuff in it. But before we do that, we're going to explore the local area a little bit more. Let's see, what do we have? We have the Gauss rifle handy. The one down thing, uh, the one downside about the Gauss rifle is that I don't think it's particularly easy to repair. So we might actually prefer not to use it too much. We don't have a lot of other weapons, but laser rifles are relatively easy to get replacements for. We're going to use the laser rifle for now. see. Is there anything interesting in this? Uh-oh. That sounds... Oh, just a mole rat. Not interesting. Okay, so we want to see if there's anything interesting in that firm-like uh, firm -like structure up on the hill. So there's a tower thing here. We're not seeing any enemies on the radar. There's an outhouse. I don't know if DC actually has many outhouses in its general vicinity. Let's see. Uh, it doesn't appear to be very much inside the house here. Oh, there's a computer, though. I wonder if it still works. Move it, dog meat! Uh, interesting. Still has power. I've never come across this thing before. It looks like there were some people here. Uh, people who are snarking at each other. Who are taking turns being the leader of a little farming community. Interesting. Well, don't know if that's good for anything. Let's uh, see if there's any way to get into this thing. No. Interesting. Not a particularly useful structure to build if it doesn't have any entrance. Oh, there are people here. Hey. Hunters. Evening. Yeah? Oh, they sell strange meat. <laughs> Here there's just some water and some fungus growing under it, which I cannot grab. I'm a little bit wary of this strange meat that I was given. Anyhow, looks like up ahead there are two landmarks that I don't have on my map. Uh, and there's something over there. Let's see, what is it? Ooh. Not good. Hua. So at some point I am gonna change companions just to show you a little bit more variety in what uh what the companions you can have are. I am really enjoy uh, enjoying playing with uh Ooh, three, four. Wow, lots of things on, on the map. One of them is due west. The other one is here. Oh, there's a person here. Another wasteland survivor. Ain't you heard of the wasteland? Is that so? Oh, wow. Well, that's good to know that people are finding use out of this thing. Scanning, Relay tower. Well, I'm glad to find another thing in this vicinity that I can put on the map. Looks like there's a switch. Turns 
found a radio signal. Cool. And we can head down to what looks like a building over there. And put it on our map. Okay, there's something that can see us, I think. We can't see it yet. Is there something down there? Might be something down here. Yeah, this looks like it might be inhabited. Well, I'm glad that I am... I have this armor that is good for... keeping people from spotting me. Grizzly Diner. Whoa! Apparently there are explosives around here. Nothing in there. Oh. Nice. A missile launcher. Chinese. It's good to have a few more options. Oh, and I think on the other side of this building, there are some guys who ha have some spare heads. Up. Another glorious day in the US Army. I definitely Although the other, it looks like the stuff these guys have is not in great shape. And I really don't understand this raider habit of, of mounting dead bodies. Uh, whoa! Oh, oh that's a trap. Wow, that it really got my heart going there. Okay, well I guess it's good to see that stuff up here. Let's head back up to the relay tower and grab some of the other uh, the other map markers that we don't have right now. Let's see, I wonder which of these we're closer to. Maybe we're equidistant. Let's put this up. Oh. Just as soon as it figures. As soon as I put peel back my weapon. I wonder if I can actually hit from here. Let's see. Yeah, looks like I can. This, I think, is probably just this little structure here. No, maybe not. Well, let's see what the structure is anyhow. Okay, there's some nasty water. And... Anything else important here? No. Just an irradiated outhouse. And, oh, interesting. This definitely looks like a structure here. Let's get down though, because I am seeing signs of life. Uh, 
Interesting. He's shooting in the wrong direction. He might not really understand who's shooting at him. Scanning, sir. Well. Okay. This is a dairy farm. Run by raiders. Bye bye. You don't mind if I ask you a question. Ha 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 ha. Okay, that really is pretty terrible. Maybe the dude is up there. I'm sure that we can give him a little bit of a surprise. Oh. Well. Okay, the skill book for hand-to-hand -hand combat is not particularly interesting to us. Is there a ladder up here? No. Oh well. Careful for traps here, but let's see. Oh no, nothing up here. That's a bummer. Okay, so are there any? Yeah, there are more nearby maps, map markers for me to learn. So let's keep moving. Might as well use that not terribly useful skill book. I guess sometimes I punch rad roaches. Although they tend to die with one hit no matter what you do, so... Oh, and here, it's these clowns. Well, let's see if we can give them some, uh... Perform some tossers on these tossers. Grenades are a lot of fun. Well, it is unfortunate that it looks like so long as dog meat is with me. Yeah, I'm not going to bother with, with their armor. It just weighs too much. Aren't there three of them? Well, there's an arm. Yeah, that is one of the interesting decisions in Fallout 3 and that you can pick up stuff from bodies just by looking at a body part. Aha! Uh -huh. Another Nuka-Cola Quantum. Okay. Well, and I have definitely more more weapons. Uh... Yeah, this takes quantum. For bottle count mines, I need lunch bot. Okay. I'm probably most of the time just going to be uh, making stuff at home then. Can you move, move, move? Okay. Let's see. Over here, maybe? Yep, that seems good. Ooh, another scoped magnum. Cool. And now that my uh, computer skill is high enough, very few words actually show up. So just getting a, a little bit of cheap experience from these things 
suddenly becomes very plausible without a lot of effort. There is first aid looking good. Okay, let's see, is there anything to do in here? Because if there are more of those levers to pull, I think those having more than pulled might be useful later. Okay, I seem to remember, yeah, there was another map marker a little bit northeast of here. Oh yeah, let's save just as we've been going for a little bit without saving. All other things being equal, you want to have a little bit more height. Oh, I think this is the Republic of Dave, which is a very silly and very funny and kind of cool. Uh, maybe a statement on, on how democracy works in small communities or just how small communities work. Hey, you! Stop! I like playing Republic. Even... Here, I'll take you to Dave. Okay. Yeah, definitely need to save here. Come on, I have to take you to Daddy. Okay, so Dave is, I believe, the elected leader for life from this community. Dave doesn't like us talking to strangers. I am Dave. Now, you are excellent. It's good to see that the Wasteland has finally recognized the Sovereign Republic of... If the people of the Waste... There's a... Thunder... Well then... My father inherited his political power from birth and renamed this great nation the Kingdom of Time. Although I also inherited... All right, sure. Why not? I'll... Not that I have. Well. Dave says you're okay? All I have... Just because Rosie used... I guess. Okay. Out with it, Ambassador. Okay, so I need to run around and tell uh, people to vote. So Jessica has already been asked to vote. I heard that Dave allowed you to. Okay. Believe it or. You're right! Dave. Okay, so she'll go and vote. Hi there! So... Bye. All done. Dave's the best. Is there anybody up here? Nope, nor up here. Man, the Brahmin smell awful today. Fingers crossed. Hello. Okay, so those two have voted. Have you heard about Dave, lady? See, is there anybody? I think people might be asleep. So we're gonna wait until the morning and remind some more people to vote. Okay. So. Uh, Come on, make it fast. All you. Man, but there's... I'm not... I'm tired of it. Okay, so he's going to go vote. I don't know if there are more people or not. Oh, there's a museum of Dave. 
uh, which doesn't seem to have anything in it. Oh, there are some pre-war books, though. And a perception bubble head. Sweet. Okay, so he's gonna vote. I don't know. Are there more people here? I can't remember. There might be one more person. Okay, I'm not allowed in the women's quarters. I'm probably not allowed in the men's quarters either. He's going to go vote. I'm going to win this. Let's ask Dave if everybody's voted. Yes? What? The ele Tell Shauna that Dave commands her to vote. And up. Let. Okay. Shauna. I need to find Shauna. There's Jessica, um, Bob, yeah. Rachel, go away? Rosie, there, honey. Flower, Have you spoken to Dave? Shauna. So, Dave, I run the... Okay, and... The... Wow. Absolutely. Oh, no. Okay. A wastelander. She'll get up like and in vote. Stories about Dave. And then Dave will. Hey there. Election Are you time. So much Republican fun, Mary. Though? Yeah. Hey, uh -huh. better Dave. Fun. Lead our republic to glory. Okay. I need to tell him that the votes are in. Hello. Hey. What? We have. Yes. What can. Good. Okay, now this is a little amusing Hello. and goofy Surprise. thing that you can do that would not work in real life. Which is... I gotta save just to make sure I do it right. As soon as he Let's unlocks this... A vote for me. And another vote for me. A vote for Rosie. Wait a minute. Has somebody tampered with the ballot box? Hmm. After counting the votes, the president is... Rosie! Rosie can't be president. No! This is unfair. This can't be. Fine, I'm leaving. See how you people do without me. Enjoy your new president. Yeah, so, the Brahmin smell. So oh. Rosie is now the president of the Republic of Dave. Morning. And I'm gonna grab that. Morning. I think I might get out of the way, dog meat. Jeez. Dave says you're okay. Rosie's. So it looks like Rosie is now the president of the Republic of Dave. Well, now, who could have ever thought? Listen, I Dave kept some big weapon or something. It's your. Okay. Cool. Old painless. I probably don't need a steam gauge assembly. And that's it. So it's now Rosie's Republic. And Dave almost as big as Dave. Dave, I think. Oh, there it goes. Yeah, Dave is gonna run off. I guess you're wondering where I'm going. I'm off to annex old only and forge the new Republic of Dave. Don't try to stop me. Unfortunately, okay. Olney is not a safe place to go. See, how close are we to Olney? Olney is over there to the west. I believe Hello. he's going to get totally slaughtered if he attempts to annex Olney. Not because people will mind. Not that anyone would care one bit about the annexation, but because Olney is full of death claws. Okay, is there anything at all to the north? We might be too close to the edge of the map for there to be anything this way. I think that's probably the case. So, we're going to save, and we're going to head northwest. And try to approach only from the north. 
Oh, let's see. Something's up ahead. Sounds like an ant, maybe? No, that m just... Made in the USA. Oh. Looks like dog meat is going to get this started. Except dog meat is now so capable that he can rip apart a yaogwai without a lot of effort. Which is nice, except you don't want to get a lot of experience if you... where this road leads us. Oh, some ammo. Always nice to have. So I think this road is taking us north of Olney. We do need to be careful not to run into Olney's nasty inhabitants. I think that's Olney over there. Oh, and I believe there are some more Oh. Red scorpions. Totally inept uh, grenade toss there. But grenades are one of those areas where close but no cigar actually works pretty well. That didn't hit anything. that to our friends. Put our grenade away and don't, th don't think they're... Th okay, yeah, that's the end of the map. We're not allowed to go further north. I guess it's a little bit classy that at least the way that Bethesda did this is that they didn't stick like an impossibly t uh, tall mountain around it. I think that's just about the lamest thing that you could possibly do. Ooh, a lot of foes this way. Not sure what they are, but there's a bunch of them. And... Uh. Again, hit dog meat. Great. Oh. Okay, let's head on down. Ah! Whoops, that was a bit much of a fall, apparently. Okay, now this is going to be interesting. You can kind of see up ahead one of the death claws. I don't know if we've met them at all. We certainly haven't seen them a lot in the game yet. But they are very, very nasty critters. Oh, well, we can collapse down some of our weapons. Let's get sniper rifle ready. Let's see if we can get them from out here. Okay. Not sure if I've even if I'm even hitting him. But he is heading this way. They are they do lots of damage. You do not want to face them alone. Cause they will fuck you up. Okay. That's one death law down. You also don't want to face lots of them at the same time because they will easily kill your companions and then kill you. 
So, actually from this ridge, that seems to be a decent place to fight them from because if we can actually th attract the attention of more of them from here, they'll have to run around to reach us and that'll give us more time to shoot them. Okay, but I'm not immediately seeing any more. Guessing that there used to be a big building here, otherwise having this raised ridge wouldn't make a lot of sense. Oh, and there is another one. Don't know if that that did manage to hit. Okay, okay. Okay. Unfortunately, we have taken on two at once now. going to be interesting. Okay, that is one less. There's the other one. Always try and injure their legs. Oh shit. Red Scorpion decided to try and join in the fun. Okay, so that didn't go quite as badly as it could have. Although I did take a death claw hit. You can see that the hit did quite a lot of damage. Because, yeah, they just have insanely tough melee attacks. Okay, I don't see anything over here. Dog meat, move. I wonder if I can safely fall from here. Let's see. Yes. Okay, I'm not sure if we can actually clear out Olney, but actually it probably makes sense to heal up a little bit. Okay. And maybe switch to a weapon. Okay, wait, no, this is too... This is a super... Okay, this'll do. And actually, with these guys, it makes sense to... Uh, makes sense to use explosives and set traps and run back and stuff like that. Like, is this an invisible wall? Yeah, it looks like this is an invisible wall. In reality, you could just hop over that border. The game isn't going to let me do it. Okay. Okay, there's another one up there. So what we're going to do is set a bottle cap mine. Oh, wait a minute. Uh, I guess we're going to actually set some frag mines. Actually, I'm going to try a bit of a novel strategy and just run backwards once I get this guy's attention, dropping mines the whole way. Oh, well, he doesn't seem to want to give me his attention. I don't know if that's the same guy or not. Hey, dude. Okay, here we go. This is how it's going to work. Oh, except he's not going to come any closer, I don't think. Well, let's... Yeah, the ability to knock foes over is a, is a pretty powerful one. That's how we do things in the U.S. Army. Hooah! Hooah! I'm not seeing any more of these dudes. Over here at least. But we're going to keep on circling and try and head into the town to, uh, to clear them out. Now, one reason to do this is that Dave is actually coming here to try and annex the town. And 
We might be able to keep him alive. But another... Somewhere in here, I think, is a... It's another bobblehead. And it's not a particularly hospitable place. So we might want to clear it out before we start worrying too much about that. Okay. Uh-oh. Brotherhood outcasts. By law. Engaging a style target. Yeah, even the Yeah, these guys couldn't take them out. But wait, who's fighting whom now? Somewhere over there. Okay. Interesting. So the two humans died. Uh, Gatling laser still in good condition. Okay, there are a few things that can be repaired down here. Hunting rifle. No, old painless can be can be repaired with the hunting rifle. Definitely don't want to do it the other way around. Can repair these outcast this outcast gear together, and then we can give violence will not be tolerated. RL3 is ready for. RL3 comes equipped with everything a good soldier needs, but your RL3 can. Good. Yeah, so they're... The robot survived. They did not. Let's see. Okay, nothing in here. Guess we're going to head in through that wrecked building over here now, then. And thus, we can get some attention from over here, which we might be able to. Every day is a good day to die! Oh. I'm just getting warmed up! Okay. That'll at least get him to come over here, I believe. Let's see. He will probably come running out soon. I hope he does not pick me as his target. Where is he? He is on the other side of the store, I think. Probably. I'm definitely putting myself in danger by taking point. If I really want to be... Haha! Aha! And because he was knocked down, Dogmeat was really easily able to take him out. Okay, I'm almost out of, uh... Out of... I'm, I've almost exceeded my weight limitation here, although I guess I can ask our 3 to carry anything particularly tough. A lot of wrecked buildings. A lot of ugliness here. And we can enter the sewers here. Oh. I am like a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle. Nothing will keep me out of a sewer adventure. Let's see, what is over here? No hoo-ah for me? Uh-oh. Yeah, my this weapon has so much synergy with my with my buddies. And Stog Meat will chew on them and RO3 will set them on fire. Ooh, some Brotherhood members. I think. Oh mercenaries. Yep, there's a Brotherhood Oh medic Medic armor. Well that's interesting. I think that's that armor will feed you uh, med packs if you get injured enough. Oh come on, get over here, RL3. Uh, uh, dog meat. God damn it, move! By your command, RL3 comes equipped with 
comes equipped with everything a good soldier needs, but your RL3 can assist in carrying equipment if needed. Okay, that's just not in a good condition. Okay, probably not going to use that since that seems to be a hunter rifle. And that's a little bit weak at this point in the game. Okay, so nowhere else to go but through here. So let's do it. Okay, a cave. Well, duck and cover. I think that's a uh, explosives. Yeah, explosives skill book. Uh, is there anything else back here? I guess not. Okay. Let's just double check our mini map to make sure that we're not completely on crack. Okay, we're not. Might be something up uh, or to the right here. Although no, it's blocked by a cave in. Ah! Okay, I do appreciate video games that can do that to me. Uh, that can actually make me panic for a second. Uh, it's not like I wet myself or anything like that, but that did make me jump. Okay, bottle cap mine. And it also probably did a number on my armor. Yeah. Oh, no, my armor's still doing okay. Cool. Okay, let's... Still try not to get surprised by death claws like that again. Okay. Did we come in this way? I think we came in this way. Because that's a dead death. So that guy must have seen his buddy and decided to check up. Okay, so I think this is where we came from. Another dead death clot. Okay. There is another buddy. Go get him, dog meat. another red marker that looks like nobody else is going to join the fray immediately let's just head up here so that we know what's around okay dead end this way another door more stairs this way let's see what's behind the door another passage and there's some supplies Darts. Good. Uh oh. Every day is a good day to die. I have a personal message for you, Uncle Sam. Getting close. It's a little bit to the right here. Yes. Now you're starting to piss me off. And just oh, nice first shot. Okay. So he won't actually last all that long, I don't think. If he's going up against Loving death claws, get out of the way, dog meat. an exit. I wonder where this goes. This is... Oh, this is... Yeah, it's a trap. It's a trap exit. Every day is a good day 
Whoa. Where did you come from? So Death Cloud Claws are actually worth a fair bit, but uh, let's try and keep this guy alive just because he's he's amusing. Okay, where does... I'm sorry, but you are not authorized to be here. Well. Okay, let's see. Okay, we've been here before. It's like Death Claws know how to operate doors. No knockdowns yet. Yeah, the problem with relying on those knockdowns is that you have to get a critical hit to actually score one. And although I do have really good luck with this character, I can't completely rely on being able to knock my foes down. Oh, there's some good supplies. This is where having high lock picking skills finally pays off. I'm at f Okay, is it this way? No, a little bit more this way. Okay. Mini nukes are only useful if you have a weapon that can fire them. And I think those weapons are all big guns, but that's okay. They're really fun weapons to use, even if you don't put a lot of points into them. Okay, so I wonder if... Am I missing some of the areas where you can go down here? Let's see. Well, over to the left, and then right, there's apparently some an area that I haven't explored. Oh, maybe not. This is not somewhere you can go. Is there anywhere else? Okay, roughly straight. Warn. Prepare to be removed by force. Oh, are you gonna turn hostile? Really? No, you're just gonna say that you are, and you're not gonna do anything. can't go this... well, I could go that way. I think that might take me out. I was so sure that there was more to this underground area than this, though. There should be... Hmm. Is there an exit this way? Yeah, there's... No, that's just the, the nook. Oh, shoot. I really thought that there was a lot more to the Oni Underground. way to turn right here? Yes. But that is the tunnel I think that we came in through. And going this way doesn't lead us anywhere interesting, although there do seem to be a whole bunch of uh, beds and lockers and stuff here. I don't remember seeing this, actually. Oh, Fat Man. I think that's one of the nuke that's one of the weapons you can use to fire nukes. Whole bunch of chests, all in close formation. I'm guessing that this was meant to be a barracks of some sort. Okay. 
take a quick nap. And there's a missile launcher and more ammo. I guess if, if you were going after these guys, you might think that a missile launcher would be good, but the problem with death claws is that they close on you really fast. RL3 is ready for RL3 comes equipped with everything a good soldier needs, but your RL3 can assist in carrying equipment if needed. Okay, RL3 is full. Yep, can't get any more from this. But this was a pretty nice find. Did I? Yeah, I did. Nice weapons. Okay. I guess I might have missed some of... Wait, wait let's see. So there's an exit to Old Olney there, and Old Olney Underground, which I don't have a key for there. Okay. Let's see. I don't think... Oh, I could, I could use this exit. Okay, so what is that? Ah, uh, that's just a coloration on the rock. I'm not sure if all the death clouds uh, are dead right now or not. And we would probably like to find keys and stuff that'll get us into more interesting places underground. If there are any. We want to be careful. Not to be surprised by death claws. So we can take them out, but we want to be prepared. Okay, there's a nice looking building. I think this is the trap that we spotted earlier. Yeah. Scanning, sir. Did, did you see something, RL3? No, I don't see anything. gonna run away. Interesting. Normally death claws don't do that kind of thing. But you might not have a f you might not fully understand where I am. Oh, and there is a uh, that's kind of amusing. this way and see if we can okay so we don't want to be outside there because the walls will block us from reaching where are our buddies okay I wonder if our buddies might have ended up in that trap really need one of those. Whoa! 